Today's video is about hot pepper red custom Bronco action. I got a Hellcat shirt on because I'm a hell raiser. Not really y'all. We are a Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram and Ford dealership. So we down with the Mopar y'all. Let's go. You can see up on Aikens Mountain, we've got custom vehicles galore. We got a custom Rubicon Wrangler, custom Ranger, another Bronco on the other side. We've got nothing but wild willies customs around but the hot pepper red two-door badlands sasquatch package on 35s is a hit but now we did some nice additions to it to make it that much more capable the hot pepper red is that bronzy reddish orange uh, color paint we did one more in a four-door rendition uh, about a week ago it looked amazing sold really quick we did black wheels on it this time decided to do fuel traction uh, in the bronze and black finish this is a new wheel we actually are doing it on a code orange raptor in all black with ddt coming up very soon early next week but uh, a good looking bronzy wheel on the hot pepper red it has some goldish vibe to it in that uh, metallic paint you can see there it looks great in the sunlight and that bronze works very well on 315 70 17 nitto trail wrapper so same size tire coming from the factory but just going from that you know positive offset to that zero plus one negative one in that area and ballpark as far as overall offset gets you a great overall stance because we're outward more outside the fender about an inch and a half to two in, about more more two two and a half inches of sasquatch fenders are wider than the uh, standard non sasquatch bronco fenders so i like to go at least a zero offset wise to get it outside the fender a little bit for a little bit more uh bad boy stance on a mild to wild scale we're like right past that mid level and the round headlights i'm a big round headlight guy especially on the a pillar first time running the six inch rigid round lights there that's a big light y'all but i actually like it i think it works nicely because it's tucked away if you use that light on that second inward mount there to me it's going to protrude too much in and not be clean enough so i still like the 360 four inch lights better i think it's just a better balance kind of in between the fog light and the headlight size but this still looks great and these six inch lights put out a lot of light so let me know what you think about the hot pepper red color first and foremost and then this is a badlands sasquatch so it's the most capable off-road rendition because you have front and rear uh, lock and diff as well as uh, sway bar disconnect and uh, other great options to make it that much more capable off-road. There's our stock number, NL A77363. Check out factory options, pause, and then there is our upgraded options. Apex Dixon package, just under 60 grand. Got a hard top as well. Uh, just looks great. Another good side shot here at the angled stance. Uh, again, do you like the black wheel? Do you like the gold wheel? I think the gold works very nicely. I just like seeing other variations besides black. It's, we do black so, uh, so frequently, but the Sasquatch package has the uh, Bilstein shock cool over set up front and rear is two inches taller from the factory. That's why we didn't have to do anything suspension wise. It's ready to roll and we don't like to upset that factory setup unless we absolutely have to. So this is a uh, slightly lower in the front about three quarters of an inch lower in the front, but not enough to where you need to do anything to it in my personal opinion. So the fuel traction uh, with entire combo with the trails with Lumar window tent and it's ready to roll y'all nothing major just some things to make it that much more capable and look even better it's been a quick one today um thank y'all for watching it's a beautiful saturday had my grandmother's funeral yesterday got ball games later this afternoon for my son so uh had to, had to meet channing tindall from university of georgia doing his truck up now a few other customers picked up their vehicle today so staying productive on the daily basis is what we're about what real is about y'all gotta stay moving gotta stay productive because we've got so much to showcase and bring to you all in the automotive industry and we're your source for everything auto at akins ford and wild Wiz and winder check us out at akinsford.com or wildwizaccessories.com got a new website it is rocking and rolling now and uh see it see all we got to offer online as always or come see us in winder for everything auto, your boys got you covered. Stay tuned for next time. Hit that subscribe button. I'll catch you later.